Wouldn't be right if I haven't played put this on my channel, man. Wouldn't be me if I didn't put this on my channel. Wouldn't be me. <sighs> this is my first Zelda game I ever touched since I was a kid. It's one of my favorite Zelda games on the N64. This one has... Uh, uh, the nostalgia just hit your boy so hard, but... Come and meet you with your boy, boo, ooh, ooh, ooh. Come and meet you with your boy, boo, jeez, hey. And you know we gotta take it easy. And you know we gotta take it easy. Cause you know that it's your boy, boo, jeez, <laughs> What up, y'all? Man, I've just been on an N64 retro days. And I wouldn't be me if I didn't record this, man. What up, it's your boy, Boo Jeezy. Shout out to the subscribers. Only, man, and we gonna be starting the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time today. I don't know who that is, but you can erase that. <laughs> I don't know who that is. But we gonna start our file today. Starting off with your boy Boo Jeezy. Can I fit my whole name in there? Yes, I can. That's a blessing right there. And without further ado, y'all, let's get into this, man. In the vast deep forest of Hyrule. Long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Man. Like, I don't know why the audio took a dip like that. I don't remember moving that. Navi. Navi, where art thou? Come hither. <laughs> oh, Navi the fairy. Listen to my words, the words of the Deku tree. <laughs> Thus dost thou sense it, the climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly! The fate of our, the fate of the forest, nay, the world depends upon thee. Ah, the nostalgia just hitting me hard today. I literally have a box of N64 games right here. I already been hitting y'all with Pokemon Snap, Pokemon Stadium, Mischief Makers, Killer Instinct Gold, so much more I want to put up on here. Okay, is he just humping the humping the rock? That little ass cat meow. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello, Bujizi. Wake up. The great Deku tree wants to talk to you. Bujizi, get up. Hey. hey, come on. Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Uh, uh. 
you finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. The Great Deku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now. <sighs> I love that little change about the Zelda games. How each, how most of the Zelda games start off with our boy Link sleeping. That's like, if I ever wanted to make a game, all my games gonna start off the same way. Like, like literally I was sleeping and then my whole life and world changed, man. I mean, this one starts off that way. The Legend of Zelda, Link to the Past, Link's Awakening, Breath of the Wild, Skyward Sword. Like, my boy Link is always sleeping and he just gets woken up either through, woken up by somebody he's always dreaming. All right, so we step out into the Kokiri Forest. Yeah. Ooh, look at that depth perception. Horrible. <laughs> but clear now. Yahoo! Hi, Bojizi! Ugh, gotta hit my voice. <laughs> Somebody drew on my tree. Let's see. Wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Bojizi! Wow! That's great news! I'm so happy for you! Yeah, me too. Now you're a true cookery, Bujizi. Sure. Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you? How did you know? <laughs> it's quite an honor to talk to the Great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Great Deku Tree. Thank you. Where the money at? Where the money at? Where the money at? Where the, I mean, where the rupees at? Where the rupees at? Where the rupees at? Let's see. Look at him. You're not allowed to leave the forest. The great Deku Tree said that if a Kokri leaves the woods, he or she will die. So you just gonna stand there the whole time? <laughs> what a brave soul you are. What is this? Let's see. House of the Great Mito, boss of the Kokri. Yep, I'm going in here. Let's see what you got for me. One rupee, one green rupee. Got a blue rupee. Got a recovery heart. Cool, cool. Got another blue rupee. That's... Man, where's your bed at in here? Let's see. Weak. You see me throwing rocks? You see that? Oh snap, that one was this one was bountiful. Alright. I'm gonna just while you keep humping that rock, I'ma just keep throwing these. Anything out of that? Alright. Cool, cool. Knock up. Alright, alright. Great De Deku Tree has summoned you. Please come with me. Alright, fine, Jesus. Alright. Hey, you, Mr. No Fairy. What's your business with the Great Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. What? You got a fairy? Say what? The great Deku Tree actually summoned you? What? <laughs> Why would he summon you and not the great Mido? I just stole everything from your house too, bro. This isn't funny. I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're gonna help the great Deku Tree without both a sword and shield ready? What? You're right. I don't have my equipment ready, but... If you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Sheesh! 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 Yeah, alright, fine. I'm gonna go do that. As soon as I find me some more damn money. Hi, 
Jeezy, look this way. Look over here with Z and talk to me with A. Like this. Yes, yes, that's how you use a fairy. It's so great that you finally have a fairy partner. I'll teach you how to talk to people using your fairy. When a fairy flies near a person or thing, press Z to look in that direction. If you use Z targeting, you can talk to people from a distance, like we're doing right now. When you have nothing that you can target, you can press Z just to look forward. Try it. Yeah, I'm looking. Alright, let's go in here. Just keep something in here. Still ain't got enough for the shield. Actually, I think the shield's 40 rupees? I don't need that. How much is shield? Yep, 40 rupees. I'm 11 short. Alright, don't even worry about it. We can fix that. All the rocks respawned. Excellent. All right, 40. That was quick. Let's go get this shield. Let's see. We sell shields, but not swords. That's cool. Can I get this Deku shield? Once equipped, you can defend with R. If set on fire, it will burn. Yeah, I'll take it. You got the Deku shield. Switch to the equipment sub screen and press A. And, and select the shield. Press A to equip it. Press R to crouch and defend. If you press R while Z targeting, you can move while defending. You said to buy something else? No, I'm broke. Alright. That's the map. Quest status. Equipment. I'm gonna go over here, press A. Wait a minute. Let's see. Equip the shield. Pop a save. Let's go grab the sword. Man, feels good to be playing this on the original hardware. Alright. Forest Training Center. Alright, sure. Let's see. Hole of Z. Let's go through this small hole. Cookery sword. Select it with the cursor subscreen and equip it with A. This is a hidden treasure of the cookery, but you can borrow it for a while. Be sure to practice with it before you really fight. Before we can do anything, we gotta equip it though. Alright. Now we got. Now we ready to protect ourselves. Alright. 
cutting grass because uh, yeah, they cast me out. Yeah, I, need all, I need my 40 back. Alright. Alright, who house is this? Okay, house to know it all. Is there anything good in here? Let's see. Let's, let's see. You want to learn about the map items? Just ask me. Okay. We ain't. We are. I appreciate what y'all doing for you, boy. But I ain't coming here for a, for a lecture. We got everything we need. We can now go visit the Great Deku Tree. So we finna head over there now. Let's see, jump. Get them five. If you want to see the Great Deku Tree, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Eh? What's that? Oh, you have a Deku shield? And what's that? Is that the cookery sword? Good grief! <laughs> well, even with all that stuff, a wimp is still a wimp, huh? I, the great Mido, will never accept you as one of us. Shoot, how do you get to be the favorite of Saria and the great Deku Tree, huh? <laughs> uh, that's why you, that's why you gonna keep standing there like that. That little beer gut you developing. Pull out my sword, at least. Oh God! What you doing? You got a Deku stick. All right, you can set it to C. All right, swing it with C. When you want to put it away, stand still and press A. You can carry up to ten sticks, but don't waste them. Sure. That was another one. Did y'all just respawn? I mean, if y'all gonna help me get up to 10 sticks, I'm all for it. Let's see, turn back around. Respawn again. This ain't a broken way to keep getting all, get all your sticks ready. Matter of fact, I might as well, okay, might as well set one to see, just so I can know how many I got. All right, I need two more, guys. Plug me. Plug me. Plug me. Four for the third eight. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. That's ten. Great Deku Tree, I'm back. This man has a mustache, and he's a damn tree. Oh, Navi, thou has returned. Ujizi, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the great Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, the vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily thou hast felt it, Ujizi, the time has come to test thy courage. I have been cursed. I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. <sighs> Does thou have the courage enough to undertake this task? Sure. Then enter, brave Bujizi, and thou too, Navi. Navi the fairy, thou must aid Bujizi. And Bujizi, when Navi speaks, use up on the sea stick to listen well to her words of wisdom. <laughs> all right guys we gonna call it a wrap up here i know you guys don't want it to end but nostalgia I, on the next episode we're gonna go inside our boy the great deku tree right here if you enjoyed the video man like comment subscribe uh, have your boy just having an n64 retro day and i'm having fun man i'll see you guys on the next episode of, of uh legend of zelda ocarina of time peace you see that line through the little polygons. <laughs>